Hey friends, let's do Fooled Around and Fell In Love Guitar Listen by Elvin Bishop. I'll talk you through all the guitar parts, all with on-screen chord charts to make it easier to follow along, and we'll do the solo at the end with the tab. So let's make a start, I'll play the intro, then we'll break it down. <laughs> So we're going to start on this F bar chord, so we have 8 on the A and 10 on D, G and B and 8 on the E. Then we're going to play the root note first, so the 8th foot on the A, then just do a down strum, then play the root two more times, and then a down strum again. And that's going to be the strumming pattern for each chord. So we have the F to A minor, same again. Now we have this E flat 6, so we're going to be 6th fret on the A string, we're going to be 8 on the D, G and B, and also play the 8th fret this time on the E there, and that's our E flat 6, same strumming pattern. And then just go to a B flat, we do the same again. And for our intro it just does that through two times, let's do that again. Six and our B flat. We do that through two times for the intro. Then for the verse, we just keep playing that progression again. F, A minor, E flat, six, B flat. Do that two more times. Then for the chorus, we do exactly the same thing again. F, A minor, E flat, six, B flat. Two more times. Then we go back to the verse again, do that exactly the same. Then for our next chorus, it's going to be slightly different. We're going to play the first chord progression through the same. F, A minor. Our E flat 6. Our B flat. Now this next F, we're going to play the root note again. Play the chord, and then we're going to play the chord again, and that's when we stop. Then we repeat the same. A minor. E flat, 6, and B flat. And that's that second chorus here, we only have the stop on the F and that's the only difference. Then from there we're going into our bridge and we're just going to play this C bar chord, we're going to do all down strums on it. One, two, three, four. Then go back to B flat, another bar, one, two, three, four. Then we're going to play this at G minor chord. We just play the 5th fret on the D, 3rd fret G, 3rd fret B, 3rd fret E, and then come back B, G, so we have. Then do the same thing, but go back to the 4th fret on the D. Then 3rd fret on the D. And then just play a C chord for half a bar. Then repeat that again, 5, 4, 3, and this time finish on a C7. And that's our bridge there, let me play that for you. From there we just play our chord progression again for the solo, F, A minor, E flat, 6, B flat, do it four times and that's the solo. Then go back to the second chorus where we've got that stop on the F and then just keep repeating the chorus to the end. And that's all the chord parts, now let's have a look at the solo. Starting on the A string, 3rd fret, play 5th fret A string, to the D string, 3, 5, slide up to 7, then go to the G string, 5, 7, 5. Do a bend on the 7, stop it, stay on G, 7, 5, 7, another bend on 7, and then stay on the G still, 7, 5, and then do a quick slide between 7 and 8, and then back to 7, back to 5, 
and then on the D string, five, slide up to seven, three, five, A, five, back to D, three there. And to finish that little section off, we have A string, three, slide to five, three, D, and then five, slide off there. Then we're staying on the A string, five to the D, three, five, slide up to seven, five on the G. Now we have this quick little run, D string, 10, G, 10, 12, slide up to 14, then come to the B string, 13, 15, E string, 13, 15, 13. Then we're gonna bend three times on the 15 E. Then just play 13, bend 15. Play 13, bend 15, play 13, bend 15. And then just play 13 E, 13 B, 13 E. So. And then we do the 13 B, 13 E, 13 B again. G string 14, pull off the 12, slide back to 10. This is a quick little run there. Then the next part we're gonna have 10 hammer on to 12 on the D. 10 on the G, 12 bend on the G, play 13 E, then come back to the G, 12, 10, 12, 10. Then we're bending on the 15 E, 13 E to the B string, 13, 15, B, sorry, G string there, 14, back to 12 and stop it, then 12 slide to 14. 15 on the D, 14 on the D, and then do two slides, 14 up to 15. Then just play 12 D, 15 on the A there, so slowly. Then we have 10, slide up to 12 on the D, G, 10 three times, one, two, three, do that again, 10 slide up to 12 on the D. 10 four times, one, two, three, four on the G. Back to the D, 10 slide to 12. G again, 10 three times. Come to 13 on the E. Do a 13 slide up to 15 on the B. And then G string 14, pull off to 12. D 12, back to 12 on the G, slide back to 10. Now we have these 13 on the G, 12 on the B, and just slide up one fret and play it three times. So. And do that six times. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And then we're gonna have 14 on the G, 14 on the B, and slide up to 17. Play 17 again, and back to the 14 and the 13. One, two, three, four. Then we're going to do something similar, but we're going to be 11 on the G, 10 on the B, slide up one fret to 12 and 11 and do that four times. Two, three, four. Then we have this little run down to finish. We're going to have five on the G, slide up to seven. Six on the E, back to seven on the G. So. Five G, five E, five G. 3G, 3E, 3G, and then one on the G, one on the E, one on the G there, and then just D string one slide to three. So that last little part.
So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed Fall Around and Fell in Love guitar lesson. Don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that notification bell and I'll see you soon.